A solemn procession through Southern California today as the body of a firefighter who died battling the Thomas Fire in Ventura County was escorted home. The procession arrived in San Diego County a short time ago. Along the way, hundreds of first responders and civilians paid tribute to Corey Iverson, a husband and father with a baby on the way. CBS 2's Tina Patel reports. It's a brotherhood. Not all of the firefighters and first responders who lined up along the procession route for Corey Iverson knew him personally, but they all feel the pain of his passing. It's just tough to talk about because, uh, number one, he was really young, and he's got a wife and two-year-old, and she's pregnant with the second. The 32-year-old was killed Thursday battling the Thomas Fire in Ventura County. The coroner says he died from burns and smoke inhalation. Although the exact details of what happened aren't yet known, many are calling the engineer a hero. With Corey, they said, you know, he got his guys out first, but he didn't get out. So, captain of the ship. It's not just firefighters and first responders who have come out here. There are also folks from the community who wanted to pay their respects and show support to the Iverson family. Hopefully, you know, the family will see us and know that they're not alone and they have a lot of prayers and support coming their way. Community members also want to show their appreciation to the firefighters who are still putting their lives on the line, battling blazes across Southern California. And these guys have to push forward knowing that one of their brothers have fallen. They have to continue to do their job and serve our community and public well. Firefighters admit they are heartbroken, but say they all get into this knowing the risks. That's what the job was, and you never thought about it. You just did what the mission dictated to do, and that's what we did. In Chino, Tina Patel, CBS 2 News.